since we're on the topic of governors, uh, how, <laughs> talk about Governor Crazy. This is a story that comes out of, it comes out of Missouri. All right. You got a guy in Missouri, Republican, Republican, again, in Missouri, uh, Eric Greitens. All right. Greitens has this affair with this hairdresser, but that, that's, that's the minor part of the story. What he does in, in this affair is he takes her home and he actually takes her there and he has a workout room in his home. He actually ties her in, in, in to, to one of the workout machines. She's partially nude and he takes photographs of her. And then what he does is he says, look, you know, I got a, I've got a political career to, I've got to protect. Uh, I'm concerned that you might go talking about what we've done here. Right. So he takes the nude pictures of her and he says, if I ever hear any suggestion that you're going to do anything, uh, say anything about what's happening here, I'm going to release all of these nude pictures out into the media. So, so what, what, what does she do with that? I well, mean, it, know, it's, it's not black, a question about black, affair. It's, it's, well, this is blackmail. Blackmail is never a good thing. Yeah, I yeah. mean, at the end of the day, when uh, you're, you're, you're tying somebody up and taking pictures in compromising <laughs> fashions and then threatening them with blackmail, that's not really a, yeah. uh, a, good, a good strategy. Yeah. Any, any stretch of the... Uh, well, I mean, first of all, the analysis is this is blackmail, right. isn't it? Okay. Absolutely. And, and there's no other way to, to say that anything else but blackmail. So people go to jail for a very long time with this on blackmail. What are they doing to support this guy? The GOP has come to his aid somewhat. Yeah, I mean, it so, depends who you know, ask. I mean, it, uh, you know, I guess there's some, some members of the uh, Republican Party that are asking for his resignation about him lying about it. There's others that are coming to his uh, support. But at the end of the day, you can't... Uh, you can't use blackmail and, and, and still have the same values that uh, that you need to serve in political office. That's kind well, of well. Interesting thing. This is a governor who ran as kind of a political outsider, mm -hmm. and he garnered. Barely won. Yeah, he he kind. You know what? He 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 tried to emulate the whole Trump thing. You know, I'm not one of them. I'm you know I'm a good old boy. I'm so different. I'm not a you know regular politician. And he gets 51 percent of the vote. Mm -hmm. uh, and and so so here the the political machine. They, it, it just seems like both Democrats and, I mean, both Democrats and Republican, uh, there's really no distinction. They're, they're going to stand behind them either way, whether it makes sense or not.